Welcome back to Champion News Talk Radio, brought to you by ChampionNews.net. This is Carol Parisi. Today, our founder, Jack Roser, and myself have Mr. Jim Edwards with us, and we have a very special guest with us right now, Mr. Dana Peelan. <clears throat> and Dana is with the Illinois Tea Party. And um, now, Mr. Edwards, you're talking about six plus six minus one. Now, Jack, you were saying there's a new passion in Republican politics oh, here in yeah. Illinois, and that is the passion of the grassroots organizations, Tea Party, Patriot Groups. They follow their groups. new mantra is from values to victory, because they have a big part. I'll tell you, the press and all are trying to denigrate the, gonna, the Tea Party movement. They are nuts. They are whistling in the cemetery. That's because guys, they fear you the are grassroots. Numerous. Well, no. and, and I heard you characterize it earlier. I think we've really gone from the uh, pitchforks and torch phase with the rallies <laughs> to the grassroots, like let's get, <clears throat> let's get people out on the streets, let's knock on doors, let's talk to people <clears throat> about your, your state futures is it hanging in the balance. Right. And, and our, our, our effort is called Let's Mobilize. It's, uh, you can go on IllinoisTeaParty.net. Uh, um, you can sign, if, if you have, uh, we're basically focusing on weekends. We'll buy you lunch. If you have to drive, we'll put you in a hotel overnight. Um, we're really trying to make it as easy as possible on the volunteers. See, that is the most important thing because I got involved in this with the Rick Santelli rant. And I know specifically last the cycle in 2010, that is exactly what the Awaken America organization focused on, was knocking doors, passionately promoting conservative values, less spending, less government, to independent voters, and that helped to, you know, move. Cause, I cause, can cause testify conservative. that this stylish lady uh, takes off the high heels and puts on the flats and goes door to door and pitches for the good folks of values. But, Every but day. you know the big difference is though, when Democrats walk, they get paid. <clears throat> That's right. We don't, we don't, we're, we're, been we're doing, it for years. doing this for our own self best interest and trying to get the candidates in that are gonna turn Illinois around. Like you said, six plus six minus one. Right. Like we're so focused in on that, like a laser beam. Each weekend we've got probably between 250 and, and 300 volunteers hitting the pavement. Those numbers continue to grow. We're, we're this and week. That's we're, in your particular area. No, that, no this that's is all over the state. They're that's doing it all over, from all the, over state. the state. We had people. I, I w walked a uh, a district over the weekend where we had people that drove three hours to walk in that one particular district because we're trying to focus all our efforts as like a laser beam right. into these areas where. You know, yeah, Democrats outnumber Republicans, but the but the independents outnumber both but, combined. But, but and now here's the very interesting thing that I found coming from a grassroots perspective, just being one of the folks. Mm -hmm. When you talk to someone as their neighbor or a concerned citizen, not someone, excuse me, from you know directly from a political party or campaign, you are speaking more real and, and, and you're concerned about the direction that your country and your state is going in. And the more you talk to people, they they relate to well, that. How many people do you find, Dana, that are hurting, that are scared, that are I, frightened? I know I have friends and uh, that uh, and they're picking up businesses and move to Wisconsin. They move their families to but Wisconsin. But when you're when like, you're walking precincts, how many people do you what are the some of the what, stories? When I you're when hearing? I walk in precincts like I um I, I we walked pretty much a whole um, district over the weekend. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, largely independent voters, they want the information. And, and I would say indiv independent voters equal undecided voters. Yeah. Because these people are hungry for information. Yep. They're, they only kind of know what they're being told and funneled through the right. media. And it's up to us to kind of get, you know, the information and literature in their hands. And we're, we're not just walking for one particular candidate. If there are other candidates within that district, we're carrying their literature as well. Whether right. you know for whether it's state senate or for some of the uh, the uh, national races. Do you find a lot of these people are starting to have non-trust for the mainstream media, where they're starting to question some of the propaganda tactics that the mainstream media is I, using? I, I think a lot of people are shaken by how far the media has gone to um, sway public opinion mm -hmm. and try and suppress the conservative vote this fall. Don't you find that, when that you brings talk up a, another point, by the way, because they are they are appealing now not to just people that are part of any group. In fact, we got to give your information out for those just yes. concerned citizens that aren't yes. part of a patriot group, aren't part of this or concerned that. Concerned citizens. And we, we need to get more of these folks out there because of that, Carol, 
people people are learning that the media is lying exactly to when it, i know when we so go door they, to door too we, it's, how do they get it's to very you? it's very easy if you go to illinoisteaparty.net and click on the let's mobilize tab at the top mm -hmm. it'll get, it'll break down the days and the times and the and the general areas within the state um, where we're focusing in all our efforts like a laser beam and if you can do three hours if you can do six hours if you just go for an hour if it's within your area you have the opportunity to really make a difference and yes. and these candidates uh, and, and, and pardon me, but the Republican Party isn't really helping them out a whole lot. Well, you know what? This is the most important and impactful work that needs to be done. And everybody, if you are concerned about the way the direction our state or our country is, hook up with these patriot groups that are doing this fuller brush, door to door, talking to the folks work. It will change elections. And if not now, when are people going to do it, I guess? And if it's not somebody who's engaged and concerned, who's going to be doing this work? We don't have many weeks left. Again, how do they reach you, Dana? It's um, IllinoisTeaParty.net and mm -hmm. click on the Let's Mobilize button. Okay. And I tell people for myself, I, I, I went from screaming at the TV, I got to be able to look at my, right. my, my kids in the eye and say, I did everything I could when it was the most important.